you're on. Here we are on the 4th of June, 2011. Carrie Newell, the, the whale lady okay, from we're Depot in the, Bay. So we're in the low zone of the rock inner tidal here at Boiler Bay. And you can see, uh, you can see the boiler, uh, ship's oh, yes. boiler from the J.J. Marhar Hoffer back in the early 1900s. And what is so incredible right now, there are gumbu chitons everywhere, everywhere. And in order to distinguish a gumbu chiton, you see this organism here, it's a mollusk. And you see my boot here, and you see gum here. So, can you remember it's a gum boot chitin? That's what it is. Now let's look at the other side of it. If we turn it over, we see a big foot. Oh yeah. And then we have some gills on the inside there. And what this chitin will do, if we hold it there, it will curl up kind of like an armadillo as a protective mechanism. Here's so one. is it a gastropod? It is. Um, it is in class Polyplacophora. It has eight plates embedded in this part of its body. It feels like soft velvet. Here is one that has curled up. I picked this one up earlier, and it decided that you no, know, it wanted to protect itself, so it curls up. There you go, you're on. Here's a giant green sea anemone. This one has its tentacles within its body because it's hot today. It's hot at the Oregon coast. Amazing. And with, with this, um, we see a bunch of rocks on the outside of this. These rocks serve three functions. Camouflage, protection from the sun, and protection from moisture loss. Now I'm going to take my finger and I'm going to stick it in the mouth, which is also the anus. So, ready? Yeah. Oh no, I'm sticking its mouth. It's also its anus. Look at that. It's got a blind sack system. Oh, it got me. Now here did we have Did it stick to you? It stuck to me. It did. Because of those pneumatocysts? Very good. And here's some aggregating sea anemones. And these are the only sea anemones that do really well embedded in the sand. And that's what we're looking at here. Aggregating sea anemones. They have pink tip tentacles when you hey, see them. Thanks, Bruce. Yes. And hey, youngins. You know, this is what Nemo hung out in. But his yeah. wasn't green like these. But they got little stinging cells called pneumatocysts on them that they little harpoons that they sting into you no I would prefer you did not go barefoot but just walk slow with your flip flops and uh, yes alright okay alright out here <laughs> 